How are we doing, folks? This is Long D out here with Dactaholics. Um, here to explain a little bit about uh, angle shooting with, uh, with rifles and long range rifles, typically. So, if we look at this picture, what you can see is basically a right triangle. Okay, here's your right angle. If we look at back at the Pythagorean theorem, back in, um, you know, going back to high school mathematics, um, very simply, C, which is our shoot our shoot to line, so the barrel to the target, is actually the longest distance. Okay, well where this right triangle comes into play is when we apply gravity. So knowing the Pythagorean theorem, knowing what, what that factual statement tells us is that C is longest, but gravity only affects the bullet on B. Okay? Which means that this is longer than B. C is longer than B. So that means our shoot to distance becomes smaller, which means we're going to hit higher. So if you're ever shooting above some or something that's above you or below you, always, 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 your bullet is going to land, is going to hit higher than that designated distance that you're shooting to. So if you're shooting at 600 yards, but you're at a 30 degree angle. You're, you're actually shooting less than 600 yards because the gravitational effect is only applied to this right angle, okay? So, bringing this all the way down, that's your shoot to distance. At what angle does this start coming into play? How far do you have to be canting the gun before you need to start worrying about what they would consider high angle? 15 degrees. 15 so, degrees or more is where this all yep, comes into effect? Yep. Anything under 15 degrees, unless you're doing extreme distances, it's not going to really come into play. I'm Long D with Tactaholics. Thanks for watching.